All right. Uh, what the hell happened to comedy? What the hell happened to comedy? <laughs> There's no drug addict sex. That's very sexist. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I'm not every other comedian that's gonna what? It's very superficial of me. No, I see inside your soul. I'm not looking at this exterior beauty. I'm knowing that you're all manipulative narcissists, and that's why you're either all single or going to be in a failed relationship. Your relationships are going to fail because you either want them for money or some status title. You wouldn't date a garbage man. What? This is fun for me. You're the people who are outraged. I bet you've gone to protests, haven't you? You're all protesting. Oh, my God, which one of you said a Me Too blog? One of you has. I know one of you sent the Me Too blog out. Oh, so what if you did? Because life is rape. Sorry you're getting treated like a male now. That's what equality is. No one gives a fuck about your problems. See, this is the manipulation. You started... No, 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 no. You came at me. Shut up. Shut the fuck up. You started coming at me. Oh, wow. No man's ever talked to you like that before. Let me tell you something. This is what you This is what you did. This is what women do. They start bullshit, and then they give this look. Oh, my God. I don't know what happens. What happened? I just started calling... I just started calling out to, I just started calling out in a comedy club and I don't know what happened. This is the narcissistic manipulative bullshit. I bet all of your boyfriends are sick of that shit and they're cheating on you with transsexuals. <laughs> 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 this is the Me Too article one right there. This is the girl that thinks they run shit. You don't run shit, sweetheart. Not in the real world. You're all cunts. <laughs> Speaking of suffering, why is it that people who have gone through a lot of suffering in life, they can come out of it kind of laughing about it, whereas people who haven't really suffered at all make their life about suffrage? See, it, this would have been so great if that side of the room was still here. <laughs> this would have fucking been phenomenal. I guess you can't really plan things in life. All right, I, I'll level you, I'll give you an olive branch. Did Louis C.K., what do you oh, think about Louis C.K.? Oh my god, you're in a comment. Fuck, fuck you, look at you, fuck you. Oh, really? Really? Fuck you. Fuck you. Suck my dick. Fuck you. Fuck you. Yeah, you did. You called out. That's the manipulation. You can't take responsibility for your shit. That's why all women are cunts. Go on. Say what you did wrong. Could you have been politer to me? Could you have been nicer to me? Could you have been more diplomatic? No. You just started with your aggressive bullshit. just insulted my fucking friend and went off. Oh my god. Fuck up and sit the fuck down, you piece of shit. You're talking to yourself, sweetheart. No, That's, fuck you. Oh my god, tell fuck this to your dad if he oh, still talks to you. Fuck yourself. Your dad fuck fucking yourself. abandoned you. You're not mad at me. You're angry. I hope your boyfriend did rape you when you fell asleep. Oh, I got 34 seconds. The future is female and slave entitled cons. Who don't know what's up? This is what women are. This is your whole protest movement. This is where you're taking your stand. <laughs> I win, you all lose, suck my dick, I'm better than you. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> Alright, this is why women are women, you know what I'm saying? It's like because of dudes like this, you know? Because this... they got outraged? I was trying to do my job. Dude, and you were talking douchebag, you know? Like, no, no, he's not. No, he's not. He's not. He's really like, you, listen, he just attacked them for what? They started screaming out at me. Exactly, that's what you women do. You start Okay, say, your time is up, so just You're stop. talking to me. That's how nice you are. Your time is up. We're not coming back to this room. There's you're talking no, to me. There's, listen, there's you're no You're talking to me, here. stupid. You're talking to me, so okay, I can respond. Okay, okay, right now you really need to chill. I don't give a fuck. Well, you do look like you do. Because you're sh no. uh, Ladies, I apologize for that. Sometimes we have crazy people, you know? So that's what, that's what you do. You know? Sometimes we have a crazy people, you know? Like they don't get enough medication. Love. Oh Their parents didn't have them enough. You're a narcissist. Dude, I know exactly. This, this is what you do at every show, every fucking show. Don't you think that I don't do the research? I'm a fucking producer. This is what you do every fucking that's what time. You Your show's nothing. You fell. Oh, like yes. That's right, that's right. We are having a killer show and so what did I say about your fucking girlfriend? I'm gonna kick your ass right now. Oh, what did I say about your fucking girlfriend? Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah. <laughs>
Do you not know what happened? Oh my god. I will fucking kick you off. Um Guys, I have jokes about Monopoly and I have jokes about Facebook. Which would you like to hear? I have jokes about Monopoly and Facebook. Well, okay. This is great. Yo, we are both doing this every fucking time with every fucking show. Don't you think I don't know? You can't put your hands on me, Cut. Oh, believe me, I can. Yeah. Oh, you can? Yes. Oh, that's my good. You want to call the police? Because I can definitely You put your hands on me. You can't do that. That's a lie. Could you please call 911? No, you have to put your hands on the ring. They're calling 911 because my... I thought after that night I could just call her and talk about what happened, but she posted this and on the slot of berating and manipulating her side of the story and everyone saying that I was in the wrong and that they're going to attack me and now they're all gathering people to band me together. This is just the first of what she had posted and look at all these comedians that don't know me getting in on it, mocking me, laughing and all this other bullshit. So then I posted the actual video just to save face because everyone's saying that I, like, attacked women, like, physically. They're saying attacked, and I'm getting all these death threats and hate mail. And now she's responded by acting like I not only edited the video to make myself look innocent, which I didn't, but now calling to ban and hate speech and provoke women and misogynistic and everyone's talking about calling the police as well as she's now inciting violence because there's these people talking about wanting to curb stomp me, wanting to take me out back and hurt me, want to show me mob justice, all these other things. And I originally tried to contact her to with the begin with and then she posted her status so I got a hundred messages. So then I posted a video trying to proclaim my innocence of what actually happened to me and still these social justice fake comedians are going at it and wouldn't stop. Just their constant back and forth of he's a danger, we have to call the police and then them invoking violence towards me and then them hating me because I was attacked by female hecklers and I was physically assaulted, and rather than admit, a woman admit that she was wrong for physically assaulting me, that they're now destroying, defaming my career, saying all kinds of things that at me that aren't true, and mocking me, and ruining any chance that I have of being a stand-up comedian just because I don't agree with what they agree with, and I had an incident with hecklers, when if this had been any other comedian, not a white hetero male, they would have let it go. And if this was a male host and it was female hecklers or male hecklers, people would have had more of an issue with it. This is complete social justice warrior. So after I posted the video, I truly had let it go and still she decided to message me, message and continue this trolling of me. And this is just open fucking harassment at this point. I made a mistake, she made a mistake, but rather than anyone admitting, I said, uh, I kind of wish I'd done better. She continues to attack, she continues to defame, she continues to lie and manipulate pathologically because this is what these people do because they think they can get away with it. Oh, and they wrote a blog about it.